Hello friends, myself Professor N.V. Patil. I welcome you all for this video tutorial session. In this video tutorial, we are going to see how to assign the material and how to check the mass properties of solid object. I already created one solid object in this CREO. To assign the material and check the mass properties, click on File menu, Prepare and Model Properties. Here you will be get Model Properties window. So by default the PTC material is assigned. To assign the different material, click on change. You will be get this new material window where three different folders are available. In previous version only two folders will be available that is legacy and standard. If I double click on legacy material, these are the different materials will be get reflected and you can select anyone as per your requirement and then assign that material to your solid object. If you don't need any of this material, and if you want to select from the standard click on this back button icon double click on standard material again here different folders are available according to the type let's consider i need to apply the ferrous metal so double click on ferrous material again different metals are available if i want to assign a steel with low carbon so i can select this steel low carbon by double clicking on it it will be get reflected and its properties are reflected on the right hand side to assign that material simply click on ok that same material will be get reflected and now to see the mass properties if you directly click on this change this mass property window will be get appear so mass will be reflected in turn because our units are millimeter newton second to see the mass in kg cancel this one and we require to change the units so here units click on change this unit manager window will be appear to see the mass in kg simply select millimeter kilogram second then click on set again new window will be appear click this interpret dimensions because the dimensions are same click on ok then close this window again click on this mass properties now you can able to see the mass in kg to calculate this volume mass area as well as all inertia properties click on calculate so you will be get reflected the volume mass area and other properties to generate this report click on generate report this new window will be get here you can able to see the volume surface area density mass center of gravity and all other properties to save this report click on file and save save this report in a proper location so in this way you can able to assign the material and generate the mass properties for the given solid object now let's close this window click on ok and close the next step we require to see the different views front view top view and side view of the given object so before that viewing this drafting view your model must be open simply click on again file new select the drawing then you can able to give the different file name con ok you will be get this new window here you can specify the template as a empty with format or empty or the ptc defined template and from this location you can able to select the different types of template so different types of templates are available i am going to select the a2 drawing sheet size so selecting that and click on ok you will be able to get the different views front view top view and side view automatically for giving the dimensions for the created views click on this annotate icon and by clicking on this show model annotations you can automatically give the dimensions for the required view and for specific dimensions you need to click on dimensions select that two points or lines then you can also able to give your own dimension so for this simple dimensions i'm going to click on the show model annotations this new window will be appear now select the required view for which you require to give the dimensions when you click on that view the dimensions will be appear if you need all the dimension simply select all dimensions and click on ok if you don't need any one of the dimensions click that dimensions so that dimensions will be get unticked and it won't be reflected after, after clicking on ok similar fashion i don't need these dimensions also then these dimensions this 360 so these dimensions i don't need after selecting that dimensions whatever not required then click on ok so all the dimensions only will be appear on that view you can also able to scale the views so to scale the views you need to double click on that view 
here this drawing view window will be appear from here you can able to scale by clicking on the custom scale by default it is a 250 so I'm going to click as a 0.3 and click on OK so you can able to scale as per your requirement you can also able to position these views as per your requirement if I click here we are not able to move that view so we require to unlock this view so click on layout here the lock view movement is on so click on it then you can able to move that view in that particular direction simply these views also also you can able to give these textiles for the different views click click on annotate here the note option is available click on here and unattach notes so if I click whenever you require you can place that and then write the name of that view like side view in this way you can able to generate the views give the dimensions give the scaling and give the naming so I hope you will be able to assign the material check the mass properties and generate the different views of the solid object very easily thank you for watching have a nice day